What's up guys, it's Solvolf here and today we're going to be taking a look at some of the new things in Cosmos Code Lab. First of all, we've got a few shout outs and they go to Amber Mines, Aaron Gill and Cool Hero Bro one yt So, the new things that are in Cosmos Code Lab, we've got three things. One of them is Wake Up Cosmo, another is Paddleball and the other is Driving in Circles for Pi Day. So there are the new things that we can do with them. So, we will do... Mm, well, the driving in circles is the oldest one, so we'll do that one first. I haven't actually looked at these myself yet. Right, so National Pi Day is March 14th. Well, it was a while ago now, but anyway. So we place one of Cosmo's cubes where he can see it. There we go. Let's move him back a bit and get more room. Once you tap the start flag, Cosmo will use Pi and Math to drive circles around his cube. So here we go. Hopefully not too far. And he stopped. <laughs> he kind of did like a little half circle around it. Basically, he just drives around the cube once and then wants to see it again because obviously he can't, he's not facing it. I'll turn him around again. Okay, so the next one is Paddle Ball. Okay, this one, uh, once you tap the start flag, move your head up and down to control the paddle. Score points by bouncing the ball past Cosmo's paddle. Try not to let Cosmo score by bouncing the ball past yours. Your paddle is on the left and Cosmo's is on the right. The first to earn three points wins. I'm going to be terrible at this. I really am going to be terrible at it. Okay, let's bring him forward, but not so much that he's off the camera. So he can see my face. Okay. Ready. Okay. Okay. Ah, that was close. Oh, okay. I thought I was... I thought I was the other one. I wasn't actually moving myself properly. Ah, oh, there we go. Now I know it's coming on. Oh, well, he's just lost a point anyway. I am really surprised that I won that because I don't really consider myself that good at those sort of games. Never mind Cosmo, it's okay. Play again? I think once is enough. <laughs> you just want to play again so that you can win. Best of three? Anyway, the next game is Wake Up Cosmo. This one looks quite interesting actually and it's the newest game in the app. So you line up Cosmo's cubes in front of you. Get his cubes back on again. Well, the reason I'm doing this to one side, obviously, is because the camera is in front of me. So uh, this is what you'll be seeing. Uh, find a friend to take turns with or play on your own. 
Once you start the tap the start flag, place Cosmo on his back when he asks. And when his cube lights spin blue, tap them to poke him. Whoever wakes Cosmo up loses the game. Okay. I'm not going to stay stood up. There we go. Whoop! He's fallen over. Maybe he'll be okay like that. He doesn't really stay very well on his, on his back. I'm trying to Oh no, I woke him up. He's really angry too because he's on this side. There we go. So I guess this one is, you see how long you can go without waking him. He doesn't stay on his back very well though, I've discovered. Turn him towards the camera, there we go. Now you can see his face. I'm trying to sleep. Hey, I'm too tired for this. Aggravate Cosmo. Oh, there we go. It's almost like he enjoys being annoyed. Anyway, those are the well, three new games. I think they're pretty entertaining. I especially like the one where you're, you're annoying him a bit. And the paddleball one is really fun too. Um, so I think there's one coming up for Earth Day. Uh, one of my friends, I think it was um, Aussie Furby Mogwai fan Milne McFly said something on the Instagram about there being an Earth Day game for Cosmo. So I'm looking forward to seeing what that'll be like. Anyway, uh, that's pretty much it for this time. So uh, this is Silver signing off. As always, don't forget to click the related videos that come up on the screen now if you want to see more of Cosmo. And I'll see you guys next time.